Not many people know about Jafar Panihi. His films are groundbreaking and have stirred controversy. Iran has very strict ideals and censors many things. This causes most films to be shot with children mainly. They don't shoot children, they shoot the movies with children in them. Panihi's films gives an outlook gives an outlook on the simple things in life. He made This Is Not A Film, which is a documentary of him in his home. This was after he was arrested for propaganda against the Iranian government. He is currently being charged with 6 years and 20 year ban for making movies. For safety purpose purposes, the interviewee, is that right? Interviewee? Alright, thank you. Thank you. Um, the interviewee's voice has been changed and they do not look the same because their face is black. Thanks for this interview. It means a lot. So first question, what's it like working for Jafar? First of all, the sorcerer from Aladdin is not my boss. As you can see, I'm not a parrot. All joking aside though, Jafar is a great boss and he treats his co-workers and actors and employees with great respect and he's very respected in the business for those reasons and his great films that really make you look at the simplicity of life. What is it like for filmmakers in Iran? How do you deal with censorship? Well, most movies are shot with children. Um, the government is kind of a hassle for Iranian filmmakers trying to get at points which I really can't get to because they're thought provoking which is the opposite of what Iran wants. They want people to be robots. Do you think anything should be censored? Is censorship a global problem? Censorship is really taken to a much higher extreme than it should be, especially here in Iran. But in America, I just don't know why they don't swear less. I just think people are too caught up with looking cool and stuff because they really don't want people or little children to hear these words so why not just not say them it makes no sense and then in like iran and iraq we're just they're just trying to protect citizens not really protect them but keep them from rebelling or thinking that their government is suppressive Propaganda against the government is a serious offense. Mr. Penny here has been charged with six years in jail and a 20-year ban for making movies. During his time awaiting travel, he made a movie, he made a film about his end of artistic ability. How do you feel about this film and what do you think it means? First of all, I find the censorship and this charge very ridiculous and rather cool. But of course, we're living in a third world country trying to keep its citizens under control, which they're probably making it less likely that we're gonna not. They're, they're probably making it more likely that we're gonna rebel. But I strongly disagree with this, and This Is Not a Film is a great showing of how Jafar is frustrated with this ban and how he'll probably not, if it's he's charged with it, he might not even make it 20 years without, with living. So, it's a real complex situation for him and for everyone involved. Lastly, I would like to say, as we all know, Iran is very, 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 very suppressive. Incre it's incredibly sad. It just goes to show a little control can go to your head. But letting people, ha ha letting it harm people, that's just going too far. Thank you. This has been 60 minutes. Even though that was much shorter than 60 minutes, I assure you this was 60 minutes. Do the 60 minutes account for the commercials or not?
They do? Yes, this, this, this has been about roughly 45 minutes due to the 7 minutes or 15 minutes of commercial. Thank you for watching.